We're in Mitchell, County Carlo this morning. I'm here with Shane Cranny. Shane is a participant in the Chagas Green Acres Calf to Beef programme. Uh, Shane will host a farm walk here next Wednesday on the 11th of March uh, at starting at 12pm. I suppose just to start off, Shane, just tell us a little bit about the system you're running on the farm. Well, we're farming 31.5 hectares. Um, we're rearing 70 autumn barn calves. We have a mix of Frise and Angus, Fye heads, um, and a few sucklers as well. Um, everything is brought through to beef kind of under two year old, mostly off grass. Shane, you made the switch to buy an autumn barn cows in 2018. Why did you choose that system? It just suited us here more because um, we're kind of tight on, on shed space. So you're kind of getting the first winter out of the way as calves and then their winnings coming in the second winter and they don't come back in again, then they're kind of finished off grass. So I just suited, suited that way. Really. So you've been in the, the Chagas Green Acres Cast Beef Programme for a year now, you're going into your second year. What are the, the major changes I suppose you made over the first year? Well, bringing everything through to finish now has been the, the main thing. Kind of changing to, to autumn, well I'd already done that, but kind of getting that first batch through and everything is finished off grass now, that's the, the main difference rather than going, going to the marathon. Okay. And did you, you start grass measuring as well? Yeah, yeah, grass measuring now. We have one full year done, so that's been a big help too. Um, kind of for taking out paddocks for silage and that kind of thing that has been a big help. And I suppose, Shane, going forward, um, what's the plans for the future? We plan plan to fishing back for for a shed, so hopefully that'll be up by the end of this year. Um, we might push stock numbers a small bit further. Uh, it should have an extra bit of land coming on, kind of for the second half of this year. So we might push up to maybe 100, around 100 calves, and phase out the sucklers in a year or two. So that's kind of it, really. Thanks very much, Shane. So I'm joined now by Chagas Green Acres Calf to Beef Programme Dedicated Advisor, uh, Sean Cummins. There's going to be four stops on the day, Sean. The first stop, what's it going to cover? So Niall, the first stop on the day is going to be spring grassland management. So we were just discussing it with Shane earlier there. We've seen that Oak Park, the mid station in Carlow, has experienced three and a half to four times the, the normal amount of rainfall. So we're just looking at how spring grassland management is coping on this farm so far and maybe what fertiliser is going out, where slurry has gone on the farm. Then we'll be looking at silage. So producing quality silage for calf to beef system is really, really critical in oil. So you want to be aiming for 72-74% DMD. So we're going to look at the steps there that are required to make that silage um, between closing dates, between harvest dates and what fertiliser is actually needed. Then Volac along with Chagas will be coming in and they'll be speaking about feeding the calf, um, how to mix the milk replacer properly, what you need in a quality milk replacer for your animal. And finally MSD will be touching on animal health. So what vaccination programmes are required and how to keep these calves healthy perform on your farm. So thanks very much Sean. So the farm walk will take place on Shane's farm here just outside Marshall, County Carlow uh, next Wednesday, March 11th, kicking off at 12pm sharp. We we'll hope to see you there.